Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Disney Diva, and I'm back again, yes, again, with another fabulous video. And I hope all my Saturday loves are doing good on this Sunday. I hope you guys are all feeling blessed and relaxed as we all get ready for work, school, and or whatever we got to do for tonight as I'm about to get ready to do after this video. So before we get into all that, for your listening pleasure coming from your ear, I got some SOS playing and this song is called Just The Way You Like It. And if you like me how I like you, Just The Way You Like It, I need you guys to thumbs up this video. I need you you guys to subscribe i need you guys to hit that notification bell now on the side note y'all know i'm the queen of antidotes so let me just give a little bit about this song i was trying my best to find this song on spotify and i am so freaking mad it's not there so i'm playing it from youtube and yes i know it's gonna probably be some ass so bear with it y'all so anyways what you guys seeing in front of you i got my little artwork going on and some i got turned around so these are my favorite pieces at the top and we'll get into all this stuff and then i got my surprise pick try not to laugh too much and speaking of that i got these nails done y'all i got them hooked up and as you can see it's that pretty pink and turquoise blue honoring my mother because my mother loved blue so i was like okay i think i think i'm gonna rock that and the coolest thing i thought that they was gonna have to put a tip i will show you my other hand but it's holding the camera so i thought i'm gonna have to put a tip on that finger i told you guys that was broken but they was able to like cut the nails kind of down kind of short as you can see because they were super long you know for some reason i got the gift to grow long long nails i wish i could do that with my hair but anyways they cut it down because by the time i go back to the nail shop maybe somewhere in january they're gonna grow long so the lady told me that somehow she was able to save the nail and you know it was broken off and was stuck on with crazy glue i don't know how she worked that type of magic magic but she told me by the time i come back the nail should grow in and if it was broken like that i mean i don't know how she did that but let's just say it was a reasonable price so let's get into my little artwork so i'm so happy with my nails so y'all know this is all over the place so bear with it so let's get into this artwork so first of all let's get into the surprise pick like i said do not laugh y'all because this is hilarious one of my uh, childhood best friends she sent this over to me and i printed it out for you guys so here we go drum roll please boom, 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 boom. okay that was stupid here we go this is a pic, oh my god, this is a pic of me being Disney Diva before I was Disney Diva. And um, this was at Disneyland. I do not remember this day. I don't even know how old I was um, in this pic, maybe about seven or eight years old. But I mean, uh, look at me, <laughs> my little rabbit uh, buck teeth. I mean, let me stop and harm myself, I was cute. And this is my mom, rest in peace, my little sister, my childhood best friend. I think this is one of my cousins on my mom's side of the family. I don't even remember him being there. And this is my um, my friend's uh, mother, rest in peace. Both of our mothers are deceased. And so when she texted me that she said, look at our angels, you know, I was like, that was so beautiful. So y'all know I had to share this little Disneyland thing. And it looked like we're in the land because I could see um, Alice in Wonderland and the teacups. I think we were on the the ride for the storybook land ride if i'm not saying if i'm saying that correctly and i do have an actual picture picture of of us getting on that and i was like so timid and scary to see it in my eyes i didn't want to play columbo to try to dig that picture up and show you guys but yeah that's me and um myself my mother and you know my sister friend and like kind of like my aunt right here and my little cousin so this takes me way back. I wish I can go back in the day and revisit this day because I don't remember anything about it. But enough said about that. So let's get into my private art collection I'm going to keep for myself and two others. I'm going to go to some other people. So this is something I did. As you guys already know, I did not draw in this stuff. I just enhanced it and color it. I did draw in that arm to extend it a little bit. And then I add in all my flares and stuff. And I feel like this little outline thing that I did when I, I have a lot of drones where I did like some type of little outline around it. I think that's like my little Sittinger trademark. And then the coolest thing that I did here, I gave her two different color eyes, like a purple and a green. And then here I gave her a tattoo. And of course it says Disney um, Diva. Sorry if there's a glare. It says Disney Diva with an arrow um, shooting out of it. And um, so like I said, that's going to go on my wall. Now, this is something I'm going to give to a friend of mine. I'm feeling this. It just reminds me of Dance Moms. Uh, <laughs> and so, uh, 
you know, I got the little fur on there. I mean, I really got into this one right here. So I think my friend, I'm going to give this to I think she's going to really, really like this. But maybe edit the fur just because the actual drawing itself had like some type of little fur uh, drawing on it. And then they had these little leg thingies. So I decided to add all that, you know, make it look bomb and make it look stand out. So all my little appliques, it's so fun to do this type of stuff. I mean, I could do this stuff for hours. So then we have that one. This is going to another friend of mine. I hope she likes this. I'm so feeling this piece right here with the um, blue and orange, you know, with my crazy little pom-poms that I got going on. So that's right, right there. Now, we're about to get into my favorite pieces, starting with this one. So this is going to go on my fashion wall. This is what I did for myself. I am feeling this pink paradise. I love how I did a tattoo on her arm right there. Uh, and, you know, I forgot the S. Don't tell nobody that. And uh, see, I got the little feather head pieces. I mean, I am just so feeling this. I'm so feeling this right here. So I came with the edit to my wall. And then this one right here where, you, where I told you guys I was going to... Um, there go the stupid ad. My bad, guys. As I told you guys that I was going to... Um, give me one second. I can actually skip this. Okay, I actually know this show is not professional. <laughs> we know it's not a professional show, but that's okay. Uh, so, like I said, the you guys seen this piece a few times. I'm so feeling this. I went pink crazy, feather crazy, beads and diamonds and, you know, um, bling bling. I am so freak, freaking feeling this piece. Um, I'm feeling like this green color I did. I mean, in, for the eyeshadow. I mean, let's just investigate that. I put like a little bit of pink and this little uh, bluish green color. And I love what I do with the feathers. And I love the little sunflower. I'm just feeling this piece, um, Pink Paradise. And then my last two pieces that we got going on here, I saw this like on Instagram and one of my little diamonds fell off. I'm gonna have to put that back on. Um, I saw these things on Instagram of, of the outline of like some color pages, print color pages of Vogue. I am, these are my favorite pieces right here. I cannot wait to add it as you guys know, to my fashion wall up there. And um, all I did was just enhance it. I did like the little open zipper part on their dresses. Um, added all the bling bling. I did like, it had like a small little head piece. So I just extended the hair scarf. I did the little uh, pin curves on the side, the little bow. I love what I did with her hat, have a feather in there. Um, I'm just feeling this and same thing here. Like I said, an open zipper. I was gonna give her pink hair, but somehow that didn't come out right. So um, I just went with the purple. So I just went with it. Um, I gave her some blue um, uh, eyeshadow, um, beautiful red lips. I love what I did with her hat with the long extending feathers. Same thing. She had like a little hair scar piece, but I just extended it out and just drew it out a little bit. Um, I'm this is like my favorite thing going on here. And then I really love this. I mean. Um, this was one whole dress, but my creativity, I did like open skin. So I did like a cutout open skin. I kind of missed up here because I was going to have this part white, but I ended up coloring it over with um, brown. I gave her a belly ring. And, you know, that's a big old belly ring. But um, I'm just feeling this. She has her black and pink hair going on. So um, I'm just feeling these pieces. Like, I cannot wait to put them on my wall. Sorry if this is fast and all over the place. You know, you guys are probably saying, well, what else is new? I'm just tired. Came back in from going to the market. And I need to get some Cinderella errands done around my house. So I hope you guys like all my stuff. Um, I can't wait to get this stuff framed and put it on my wall of fashion. Like I said, I'm really feeling these. I'm going to print out more, try to find more of this particular artist with this. Um, I don't know where I found this one at, but I'm going to try to look for her again and print out more in color. I think I got addicted to this. How I got addicted to like the Barbie stuff and this right here. Yeah, I'm, I'm starting to feel this right here. You know, maybe I can have like a little booklet of these or maybe any give them to people. And by the way, a lot of people tell me they got my artwork. Well, I should say my coloring and design because I didn't draw these things. I just enhanced it with my creativity and a lot of people were, were really feeling it and liking it and i'm so glad that they did so this is disney diva signing off i hope you guys have a blessed work week a blessed um safe and wonderful life weekend because i don't know the next time when i'm gonna come up on here 
Um, Y'all just stay blessed and stay safe. And you guys definitely know what you need to do. Keep that magic and deuces. Your girl, Disney Diva. Have a blessed day.